Hey, those uh, those who are having issues with shaders created in Amplify or any other external uh, shader, like there'll be a custom editor line in the code of the shader that it was created with. And this is just so that um, it can easily be edited by those who made it. So when I'm editing like shaders, uh, when I open them up, it will allow me to use uh, Amplify shader. Now, it does have a drawback where it spits out this yellow warning. It's not a big deal, but it's maybe bugging some people into, like, they want their console to be clear, right? So if you want to get rid of it, just, you know, just open up the shader uh, by code, right? Just double click on it, open it up, and then just, you know, scroll down to the line where it says uh, custom... Uh, where is it now? Custom editor, right? And just comment it out. Now, this is just this is what Amplify Shader creates. Uh, so maybe when I've finished making a pack, I can just comment it out. But it also means that if someone's got Amplify Shader and they want to change anything, they've got to go back in and like take it away. So it's it's six and a half a dozen whether you want to you know just ignore the warning or if you want to get rid of it you can just save these All right and then when i clear this and drag in like a prefab now and play or whatever like i'm not going to get the warnings so that's that's how to do it so thanks for watching bye